Are you in the club? Hey guys, welcome back. This is Amy Jo, and today I'm gonna to be showing you Adrian Adams from Project MC Squared. We're also going to be building a volcano. And Princess Anna's gonna be making a special guest appearance in our video as well. We have lots to do, so let's get started. Before we start our science project and look at everything that comes with Adrian, let's take a look at the doll herself. So she's really lovely. She has lots of long hair and beautiful eyes and real eyelashes. She also has on a really cute outfit and this is an outfit that she wears on the show. I don't know if you guys have seen it, but it is a Netflix exclusive. And I've been watching it, and you know what? It's really cute. <laughs> it's a cute little program, so you guys should check it out. So it looks like her clothes are removable. Let's see. They sure are. Okay, so she has on a little necklace. She has on a cardigan, a pink shirt with a cute little belt with a bow on it, and then a skirt. And this is definitely the skirt from the second episode. Wait till you see her shoes. She has these really cute shoes, and look, removable, and she even has on little socks. Let's see if those are removable. Oh, they are, it's a little tight. <laughs> so these dolls are really articulated. They bend at the elbow and the wrist, and their hands are removable, so they pop off if you want to take them off to make changing clothes a little easier. They also are articulated at the knee, so they can sit down pretty easily. Here is a closer look at Adrienne's face, and I wanna tell you a little bit about her character. So Adrienne is really smart, and she really, really likes to cook, and she loves science and chemistry. Her family came from Spain, so they recently relocated here from Spain, and she loves rescuing animals and hosting dinner parties. So on the show, Adrian and her friends are in high school. So that is how old they are. And see how realistic her eyes are? I'll just give you a quick little comparison. So there's Princess Anna. She actually has no eyelashes. <laughs> she doesn't even have any painted on. And there are Adrian's eyelashes. There are four different characters in the show, and each of the dolls has something different that they specialize in. And so, like I said, Adrienne really loves chemistry and science, and there are her glasses. I wanted to make sure I put those on after I showed you her pretty eyes. And this particular Adrienne comes with a volcano making kit. She also comes with a doll stand, which makes me really happy because I can just set her here and talk to you about this. So these are the other accessories that come with this particular Adrian, but you can buy Adrian Adams on her own as well. So now let's talk about the volcano. To make a volcano, you need a couple of ingredients. Baking soda, food coloring, vinegar, and the volcano. And now Adrian can tell us what to do. Okay, yes, the very first thing that you need to do is place the volcano on the plate. That was perfect. Next, you're going to add one teaspoon of baking soda to the volcano. Now, add the food coloring of your choice. I suggest pink because that is my favorite color. You did a wonderful job, and next is the most exciting part, when the chemicals react with one another and create an awesome volcano. Are you ready to add the vinegar and see what happens? I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I am ready. Okay, everyone's ready. And I have filled our dropper with vinegar. So here we go. Let's watch that again. Ah, oh, that was a perfect job you did. Isn't science amazing? 
Oh my gosh, I can't wait to tell Elsa about this. Elsa's got some really cool superpowers, but oh, I don't think she can make a volcano. Well done, Adrian. Oh, thank you, Anna. I can teach you how to do it. Chemistry is so cool. I definitely want to learn. I hope you guys will want to learn as well because I have several other science kits that come with the Project MC Square dolls and I'm excited to show them to you. Okay, so what I'm doing right now is I am making my own volcano out of Play-Doh. For those of you that might want to try this science experiment at home, you can grab some Play-Doh and the supplies that I named off earlier, and you can make your own Play-Doh volcano. Okay, so that looks pretty good. So I'm kind of going for something like this. It doesn't have to look exact. Actually, you could probably use, <laughs> you could use like a, a leftover or an old toilet paper roll that doesn't have toilet paper on it anymore. You just need something to put the baking soda, food coloring, and vinegar down into. Okay, so this is going to be our volcano, our little Play-Doh volcano. Okay, get the extra Play-Doh out of the way. And now I wanna make sure that I press the Play-Doh down onto the plate. See how that looks? So, the reason I'm pressing it down along the bottom of the plate is so the baking soda and the vinegar don't just come spilling out the bottom. Okay, so this is where we're gonna put all of our ingredients and we're gonna make our volcano erupt now. So we can add our baking soda. Whoa! <laughs> that was kinda messy, wasn't it? Now it looks like we have volcanic ash on the side of our Play-Doh volcano. I think I'm gonna turn this around so that you can see this better. Okay, next we're gonna add some food coloring. And the only thing the food coloring does is dye the vinegar and baking soda so that you can see it better. And next, vinegar. Here we go. Oh, I hear it. Is it doing anything in there? Maybe our volcano is too wide and tall. Or maybe we need more vinegar. Let's see. Ooh! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, here is one more look at Adrian and our volcano in the background. And next I wanna show you the other Project MC Squared kits and dolls that I have, and you can choose which one I'm going to do next. Okay, this is Cameron Coyle, and Cameron Coyle loves to build things. So she comes with a really cool skateboard kit. And here is a quick peek at her. So this is Cameron. And this is Michaela McAllister. Michaela is kind of the main character in the show. So if you watch it, you'll definitely get to know a lot about her. And her project is to make a lava lamp. Okay, so Michaela or Cameron? And that's it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed learning more about Project MC Squared. Make sure that you leave me a comment and tell me if you'd like to see me open Michaela McAllister or Cameron Coyle next. And if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more like it, you can let me know by clicking on the like button. This is Amy Jo with DCTC. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Another video, that's the end. Come back soon or we'll miss you, friend. DC, DC. We do toy reviews. DC, DC. And we play with Play-Doh, too. Skits, pranks, eggs and toys. We make videos for girls and boys. Uh-huh, uh-huh, that's right. <laughs>